Hi everyone, I hope you're having a good day. It's Carolyn from Mommy Ramblings, True Crime Chat. And I just wanted to go over some just preliminary updates to the hearing that's going to be taking place at 4 p.m. today for Letitia T. Stock. Um, there's going to be extra security in place because emotions are running high. So let's take a look at this and just to note the ASMR in the background is the turtle tank for those of you that are new to the channel. And if you are new to the channel, why don't you hit the subscribe button and the little notifications bell so that you'll be advised of any video we put up, hopefully with the help of YouTube, and uh, can join us for true crime chat and crafting and everything else we do on this channel. And you never know what that could be. So extra security amid high emotions. Sergeant Deborah Minot with the El Paso County Sheriff's Office said that additional deputies will likely be on hand during Letitia Stouk's hearing at the El Paso County Courthouse today. Emotions surrounding this case are running high. She said our security is not only for the public, but it's for any inmate who's in custody. We provide security measures. This there is a protocol that we follow. We don't want the courtroom plugged up with additional persons. Now, regarding the unsealing of the arrest affidavit, we're going to talk about that in just a second here. The time of the hearing, again, is 4 p.m. in Colorado, and that was scheduled when traffic tends to be lighter. Minot did warn that only a few dozen people or so will be permitted inside the courtroom due to its small size. Media outlets are asking to have Letitia's arrest affidavit unsealed. Media attorney Stephen D. Zansberg filed the motion on Monday representing 14 Colorado media outlets. There is no opposition from the state, but T's public defender opposes unsealing this document. Recap of the charges so far that Letitia is facing murder in the first degree for a child under 12 from a person of a position of trust, child abuse resulting in death, tampering with a deceased body, tampering with physical evidence. So um, on the East Coast, this hearing will be 6 p.m. Colorado, it's 4 p.m course we will be updating you I may uh, be live right after I'm not sure or there may be a recorded recap and we'll discuss it live later on this evening but you know never fear we will be discussing it all right I hope you guys are having a great day and thank you so much for watching again please make sure you're subscribed if you like what you see on this channel and I hope that you do and click the notifications bell so that you will be advised every time we upload something new or we go live. Have a good one, guys. Bye-bye.